can you all upload multiple images by using drf if not this is the right video for you all so welcome back guys this might be the final video that is part 4 of this series whereby we cover all the types of upload in Django and Django REST framework. So in this video, I'm going to cover single and multiple image uploads by using Django and Django REST framework. In the previous video, we have already covered up the file upload. So y'all can check that out. So let's start by going to the serializers.py and we'll first create our model serializer. So I'll start by creating the image serializer and this will take in serializers dot model serializer and this will have class meta same as uh, this so i'll type in class meta and model will be the image model image model and fields will be all oops this should be underscore and let me clear off this extra import and uh, this is our model serializer and let's create a serializer to do the multiple uploads as well because this will be only handling the single upload so i'll call it as class multiple image serializer this will take in serializers dot serializer and i'll give it images over here and this will be taking serializers dot here list field because we are going to send multiple images as a list and then uh, that will consist of a child serializer so that will be serializers dot image field so as you can see the difference between uh, the mul multiple image serializer and the multiple file serializer is that uh, the child serializers are different over here the child serializer is file field and uh, and in the multiple uh, image serializer the child serializer is image field but both of them are lists okay so our serializer is ready let's go ahead and create our view set for this so we'll start by creating our model view set so i'll call it as image view set this will take in view set dot model view set and uh, i'll give the query set over here query set will be image model dot objects dot all and then it will also take serializer class which will be uh, let me check if i have imported it or not no so let me import it over here so from dot serializer we need to make sure to import all the serializers so there is one image serializer and multiple image serializer so the serializer class in the view model view set will be the image serializer so this will handle all our uh, requests that is post put get delete so our single upload will be handled by this itself so let's go ahead and create url for that and over here i'm going to just duplicate this one router.register and instead of file i'm going to call it as image and this will be image view set so this should handle our routes as well now let's run the server and check it out oh wait before that we also have to make changes in our index.html because our url is changed now uh, let me comment this one uh, copy first of all and comment and then let's change it so the route which we gave is image uh, let me check it over here yes image actually yes let's keep it as image itself and everything looks not fine uh, we have to change the files to image uh, wait 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 let me first of all verify it in models.py okay so image model also has a field called as file itself so we don't need to change this to image but we have to keep it as file itself and let's change uh, the type of file that we uh, allow user to select over here uh, right now i'm doing single upload so i'll remove the multiple and then i'm going to paste in some code so this uh, this is okay let me remove multiple except only images this means whenever user clicks on this input file button we will allow only images to be selected and not other file types 
okay so that will take care of our validation as well we don't have to manually do validation in the javascript so let's now save and run the server please make sure to activate your environment my environment is already activated because of vs code and sometimes i just love it and let me check where i am okay cd into source and python manage.py run server refresh the browser and let's go to admin as well oops it is admin should be able to yes correct and uh, image upload okay so there is no uploads yet let's try to upload one of them okay i will upload this file let me select it submit let's check what happened because i really haven't done anything on the front end that will tell us whether it got uploaded or not oh okay okay i understood what the problem is uh, so in django we have to make sure to specify front slash at the end of the url because that's what by default it is configured to so let me refresh the page and do it once again let me select the file that is image so if you'll notice uh, only the files allowed are of type images so i'm going to select this file and click on form submit and 201 voila we have success over here so let me refresh on the admin side and there we go a uh, file object has been created and if we click on this the same file comes so that means we were able to successfully upload a single file now let's do the coding for the multiple file uploads so we'll go in the view set uh, let me actually remove this for now and we'll start by creating our own endpoint so i'll start by creating action because this is a new endpoint detail will be false detail will be false why is that because we are not going to send any uh, ids in the url so detail is equal to false and the method allowed will be only post okay so i'm going to only check for post and then def multiple upload this will take in self request arguments and keyword arguments now over here i'm going to directly send the whatever the user has submitted to the serializer so that will be done by multiple image serializer and we are sending data as request dot data or send none okay and we are going to store this in a variable called as serializer now we are going to validate this serializer so that will be done by serializer dot is valid and raise exception as true this will make sure that we have only the file that is image type and if there are any errors it will throw error from here itself it will not proceed now we are going to remove all the images from here so serializer dot validated data so validated data dot get and i'll take in images from here now we are going to do same thing like we did for the files uh, because we don't want to hit database every time say if there are thousand images we don't really want to hit the database thousand times to save all the images so that's why we are going to do the bulk create for that i'm going to create a list image list and then iterate over all the images so for image in images i'm going to do image images list dot append uh, it is append and in this it will be image model then it has a file uh, field called as file and file will be the image image okay so our image list is also ready and af after the for loop ends we have to check if uh, image list exists so image list if image list then we are going to do the bulk create so it will be image model dot object dot bulk actually bulk create and we are going to pass in this list so once this is done that means our bulk create is done successfully we are going to return the response the response will be i'll return it as success what you all can do over here is instead of returning success you all can take the entire list of all the images from here 
assign it to variable and then pass it to the serializer and y'all can return that instead of success over here but uh, for this video sake i'm going to keep it for minimalistic and will return success let's save it and we have our new endpoint called as multiple upload so let's go to the index.html and the url will be image slash multiple upload and uh, over here it will be multiple not just single means by default it is single if we specify multiple we will be allowed to select multiple files that is multiple images itself so let's run the server again just to verify we have only one object right now over here and let me refresh the page clear this and we'll select two images okay both of them looks same so we'll select two different images and submit oh something happened okay i think i know what the problem is so let me go to the code and show y'all so if we go to the serializers in multiple image serializer our field name is images okay and in index.html when we append the data we are submitting uh, appending it as file so we have to give it as images let's go back to the browser refresh this clear this and let me select two different images submit and 200 and success is come so let's go back to this uh, admin side and we'll check yeah two new objects are created so that's good and if we go back to the vs code let me minimize all these things inside this media inside the images as you all can see all the image files are getting saved in the img folder that is because in models.py for image model we have specified the upload directory to be inside img that will be inside the media and img all the files will be saved thank you guys for watching this video and this series i think this might be the final video of this series if you all have any other request for the video make sure to comment them below like this video subscribe to our channel and share see you in the next one